You gonna go eat your dinner? Or did you eat already? Kiki, ki. come here. Come here. Are you teasing me? Hi, come here. I see you. She's over there, she's fine. She's not gonna bother you. Come here. I think the reason why this gets like pink is because of my shirt and my hair, huh? Anyway, so I'm getting ready to take Miss Maggie for a W. Can't say it out loud. She's having dinner right now. So I'm getting dressed. I have to put on a lot of layers because it gets so cold. And I want to be able to hang in there long enough. And also, I should mention, today is self-care Saturday. So hoping to take a walk, hoping to do some pampering, and hoping to watch Arsenic and Old Lace. Uh, so we'll see. And also, I just had my husband got me something that's not vegan, a cake that was for my birthday, because I always like to have a cake for my birthday, but it wasn't vegan, mm, but it was good. Um, but so then um, I'm drinking my electrolyte water, and I had a big bowl of fruit to help me, and my husband, he's changing the kitty litter box. So that's what's going on currently. For a walk, had my session with you know who. She's drinking some water. I'm getting ready to drink some water for myself. We have fun, huh, Maggie? Yeah. Are you filming? We're both doing good. Yeah. Okay. You I filming? It's already filming, so you could just. You're on. <sighs> just went for a walk. I'm kind of. <laughs> I gotta undo this. Look, I got so many layers on because I hate being cold. <laughs> My goodness. Da -na -na -da. Boom. 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 <laughs> <clears throat> but yeah, I just went for a nice walk, continuing on with my quest to do self-care Saturday. So probably going to take a shower, do a little pampering, and then we're going to try to watch Arsenic and Old Lace. Hopefully That's that works out. That's a movie out. from the 1800s. No, it's not. It's really funny. You're going to love it. All right, so yeah, that's what's going on so far. I'll be checking in later. Pampering, and I just kind of wanted to share some things that um, some of you may already know that I'm using, um, and just letting you know some new things uh, as well. So I finally broke down and got one of these. I haven't tried it. I'm going to try it today. Um, it's really important to follow the instructions. It's really important to sanitize it with um, alcohol. Isorful, I believe that's how it's pronounced, alcohol. So always do that every time you use it. It's very important. So anyway, I'm going to try that today. I have that alcohol. And what else? I found, you know how this is like the latest craze right now is this pink jade. There's the, there's the, is it jade? I don't think, is there such thing as pink jade? But anyway, there's jade and then there's this. I got this in the box from a thrift store. I'm so excited, I can't wait to try it. So it's supposed to help absorb, there's supposed to be some healing power. I don't care about that. I don't ascribe to that kind of stuff. Some people do and that's great, just not for me. Um, but it is supposed to help with, um, if you put it in the freezer or refrigerator, it helps with circulation. You know, it's just a fancy thingamabob. Who knows if it really works. I had to get, reorder this again. I love this stuff. Blue Tansy, if you're looking for the the Sunday Riley, um, uh, what is it called, Luna? I think that's the one that has the Blue Tansy. And you can't afford that? Try this. It's wonderful. This has, um, yeah, rose and Blue Tansy, so you can't go wrong. And it's vegan, so. I got these two things from Five Below. They're cute. It's pretty. Um, it doesn't last very long, but that's okay. I really like this one though, um, the Blossom one. It smells really good, it just doesn't last long. Um, the sprayer, let's see here, let's see if it still works. Oops, let's see if it, oh, okay, so it kind of works. It doesn't work that great, but you know, it's five bucks. Uh, I have fallen in love with this. Okay, you guys, this is what you need for quickly when you're getting ready 
and you just need a quick shave, you know, for especially the stash situation. Um, this is fantastic. I, I love it now. So just don't put any lotion on beforehand because it's going to stop working. Uh, love this. Highly recommended if you love listening to music in the shower. This is it. Check it out. I just put it, um, I just put it in my shower and I can turn it really loud and I love it. So definitely it's a stereo for your shower. Now it's not going to be like a booming bass, but it's pretty good. Lastly, let me talk about this. I'm super excited about this because it has a rose, uh, um, scent to it. It has all kinds of good stuff in it. I still am, the jury's still out on this because when you initially spray it, it smells really bad. However, once it dries down, it does seem to leave a nice fragrance. So still not sure. It's really great for my hair. I love that you could just mist it. It's still out about whether this is good for the body. So anyway, just thought you would enjoy that. So I'm getting ready to do my thing and we'll check in, check, check in, check in later. Out of the shower, totally uh, vegging out. Got my socks that have aloe in it. It's supposed to make my feet all soft. I absolutely have to start putting stuff on my nails because they crumble. I never used to have that. <sighs> Old people's problems. Anyway, so I have to start doing that. So I did that, especially when I come out of the shower. And watch this thing about the Ace family. Uh, yeah, they're an interesting group of people, and like I said, oh, and I and I um, had my fruit, and now I'm gonna have some of well, my favorite Brussels sprouts with corn. Do we have any carrots? No carrots. Oh, no carrots. I got everything for you today, but the stuff you're asking for, so I apologize. That's okay. I That's got okay. Everything but the stuff you're asking for. It's okay. Don't feel bad. So anyway, so I'm getting ready to have that with corn and rice as my dinner. Woohoo, can't wait. And I might have some of that cake too. Oh! When you're going through the change, when they have to do the pauses in the meno, uh, so I got to deal with my nails crumbling. Um, the other thing is chafing. I've never dealt with chafing before until now. So now I have to make it a regular thing for me to put baby powder. I never had to do that before, but now I have to do that. It's just like the things that you have to do as you get older. It's like, oh my gosh, it's crazy. <sighs> so yeah, I got to do that. What else? What else was I thinking about? I can't remember, but just so many things you got to do when you when you're making the transition. It's a bi it's a big deal. I don't know what was what with my mom. I don't have anyone to refer to as far as uh, my uh, mom or my grandmother. They're both passed away. But when I did ask my mom, she said she went into a store and she felt really weird when she turned 50. And that was it. I'm like, okay, that's really not a whole lot to go on. So, <sighs> that's what's going on. But anyway, I feel really good for my shower. Yeah, I remember what I was going to talk about. The other thing that happens as you get older is going through menopause, which is something I never dealt with before. And it's just like having sweating. Like, I mean, I get the hot flashes, but like sweating a lot. I never used to have to deal with that so much. Maggie, she doesn't sweat. Look how cute she is. Anyway, so, so yeah, that's the other thing. So I keep going through all my robes. I got to wash them like regularly. I never used to have to do that. I could have like one robe for weeks, literally. I mean, it's not exactly, yeah, but anyway, it wasn't that bad. But now it's like, good grief, Charlie Brown, who... Is that me? You know what I mean? It's crazy. So that's yet another thing.